Uh, once again, from Bron BronyCon, this is Joe Stevens. And this is TechRat. For the Equestrian Inquirer. We have on the panel here, if you would pan over to the right there, we have Lauren Faust. And TechRat, who all is in that panel? Well, right there behind Lauren Faust, I do believe I see Lee Tokar. Lee Tokar, hello. And beyond that, I do see Peter Mew there Peter as well. Peter Mew, back there in the hat, I believe. Yes, and I believe, is that in the front, in front of Lauren, is that... That's not Megan McCarthy, no, no. No, no, I believe that that might, is that Kathy Weisluck? No, that's not Kathy Weisluck. Okay, we're really bad at this if we don't know what they absolutely, look like. Absolutely, <laughs> We need to learn more. You know what, we'll, we'll ask them to wear name tags. Oh wait, they are wearing name tags. Yes. I'll go over and look at the name tags. Yes, we'll go over <laughs> there. And as you can see, if you look on the lines, uh, they have cut off autograph uh, folks. And we're gonna try and see if we can talk to someone who just uh, autographed, got an autograph, and we're gonna talk to some of the other people here. Actually, if you wanna scan over here, Oh, okay. We got a couple of people coming through right here. Let's we'll see. Excuse me, sir. Would you mind talking to us for a second? Oh, you're so okay. Oh, okay. You just met with Lauren Faust, correct? Mm -hmm. Yes. What did you What did you ask her about? Uh, can I have a picture? You got a picture with Lauren. Good. Did you? Can we see the photo shot of it? We got a. He took a, a picture with Lauren Faust. Isn't that wonderful? Show it to the camera. Show it to the camera. That's it's wonderful. Very good. Wonderful. So, how long have you been a fan of My Little Pony? Um. Three months ago. Uh, three months ago. Oh, so new to the Bronydom. What do you think about the convention so far? Too many people. Too many people. <laughs> I can sympathize with that. Very good well, observation. Thank you very much for stopping by with us. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So it looks like very fortunate for you. Actually, we're at a pretty interesting spot. Not only are we seeing a lot of traffic, not only are we seeing a lot of traffic of people, but we're also right near Pixel Kitty's booth. If you can see her, she's in that night, white, a nice white and red shirt and it looks like her booth is hopping she's getting lots of sales lots of people there are lots of interesting booths here there are a lot of people selling different things and tech route show off your badge that you bought from pixel oh absolutely kitties. this is a pixel kitties exclusive this is princess trixie and she has a number princess of different characters trixie. like this she has princess celestia princess luna queen crystalis and all kinds of other designs again wonderful wonderful things available at pixel kitties booth and so we'll let, we're going to try and see if we can get some VAs or actually we're going to try and see if we can get some cosplayers that want to get talk to us on air. Let's see if we can find anyone uh, particular We have an instance. awesome Twilight Sparkle walking by. We have an awesome moment. Twilight Excuse Sparkle me, miss, would you mind coming with the book. Inquestry Inquirer, indeed. Thank you very much. We have so a Twilight Sparkle. This is a wonderful Twilight Sparkle as well. All right, my first question is how long exactly did it take you? Especially, can you pan down here? Check out these leggings that she has on. Check out these awesome... You just poked me with your horn. <laughs> All right, you know what? I don't that, want to talk to I'm you anymore. Let's that, find that, that, can be a tra that can be a, a danger with being a unicorn. <laughs> is we don't did, realize that. We have nice flat foreheads. With yeah, unicorns, yeah. you have this thing poking it. You, you imagine be, if you're a Japanese, it'd be even worse. That, that would end badly, I do yeah, believe. Yeah. So did you get a picture of these leggings down here? These awesome purple leggings. They're just fantastic. And of course, the And let's the look at this as well. book. This is wonderful. Like, does it say, now, what, now let's do the cover. Show us out to the camera. Elements of Hong Harmony. Now, how long did it take you? I assume that you did you make this book yourself? Uh, yeah, it's actually it's actually a box, like one of those box books, and I covered it with felt and everything. Okay. It took uh, well, I did it yesterday, so it took like maybe like six hours. Wow, very and nice. And, and I see that we are mystery on the M Express. Actually, um, I'm actually Twilight from My Little Investigations. Oh, yeah, I apologize. It's the band-based yes. game. Oh, My Little Investigations, I've heard yeah. of that, actually. Oh, okay, I'm terrific. Actually, I'm actually Twilight in it. I'm Princess Rill on YouTube. So. Wow. So not only do we have a cosplayer, but we have a voice acting cosplayer here. Can we give a little sample of what you've do been doing in this? Uh, sure, hang on. This is my book, and I'm going to read it! There you go. Fantastic. Thank you very much for that. Thank you. Okay. Would you like to get in? I think we're getting set up for a live stream, but hey, what's your name? I'm Corey, sir. Corey, what are you doing at BronyCon? Do you are a big brony, I'm assuming. Well, I just, I, I kind of started a couple months ago, and this is my first convention ever, period, of anything. Wonderful, wonderful. What's your favorite part so far? Well, I just met a lot of artists that I've always found amazing. Tumblr, even here, which on a show, I'm, I'm just, I'm speechless seeing, meeting all these people. That's wonderful. Have you bought anything yet? What, uh, let's see. Yes, what what did you buy? What did you buy? A sketch from Ooh. Rhea, the lady who does, the woman who does My Little Chubbies. My Little Chubbies. Okay. The Tumblr. Yeah, let me just get it. Look at how lovely that is. 
Thank you. That is oh, wonderful. Look at that. We got the chubbies right there. Very nice. Is that a signature? Is that an autograph too? Did you get autographed as well? She gave me an autograph. Very nice. I, I have a crappy job, and every time I see her pictures, it makes me have a big old smile. That's wonderful. Here's your rubber band you thank dropped. You in. Yeah. Well, thank you very much, Corey. Nice Hope you enjoy the rest of the uh, thing. Nice and hair for both of you. Oh, well, thank, thank you very much. We do our part. <laughs> All right. What's our time at? Five minutes. Five minutes. Okay. What we're doing here is this is actually extra special footage. This is not being broadcast on the live stream. This is new stuff. Uh, this is us doing it for the Equestrian Inquirer. And for the lulls. And for the lulls. We do it for the lulls. And if you'd like, let's see here. Do we have anyone? looks like Lauren Faust is up and talking to someone. And we have, oh, look at that. The, the little kid trying to get Lauren Faust to. to I see the, oh, oh you're doing that. Pinkie Pie. Look at this. She's got a big Pinkie Pie plushie. It's a, it's a, it's a full Pinkie Pie. Okay. Okay. <laughs> And let's see here. Looks like they're and talking. And apparently she's had leg surgery. Oh, the poor, poor Pinkie Pie. <laughs> and let's see here. Actually, it looks like they might be letting more people into the autograph line. It's just you had to have a certain badge to get in. I think that you had to pay to get in there. And so hmm. let's see if we can talk more to the crowd. Looks like the crowd is really picking up because the next panel is actually going to be the voice actors, correct? Um, I think we have let, let's ask our program director over there, program Mr. Moose. Director, Mr. What LTT is coming Moose. up next for the panels? Uh, let's see here. Next on the list of events is Behind the Voice simulcast. Behind the Voice. That means all of our Everfree Radio simulcast is going to be on that. And it looks like we have a wonderful looking Applejack here. Applejack. Oh, that is fantastic. Can we get, get Applejack? Can we get excuse Applejack? Me, excuse me, excuse me, miss. Oh, would you like to be interviewed for our Equestrian Inquirer? Sure. Absolutely. Please awesome. come over here. Go ahead. Oh, sure. Well, that, that is an absolutely wonderful Applejack costume. If you, if you can just kind of if step back here so you can see this in all of its glorious splendor. You can see that she's got the cutie mark on her shorts there. She's got let's the give us a, Let's give us a, a swirl. Uh, uh, hat. Do a runway absolutely off. There you wonderful. go. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. wonderful. So, so, so tell me, how long did it take you to put this costume together? Um, it really didn't take me like that long to really put it together since I, since I bought most of the parts. Except for the, actually to do the cutie marks, it took about a half hour. And it took about three layers of fabric paint just to do the cutie marks and probably about 20 minutes to um, spike the bangs on, on the wig to get him to stay. And is Applejack best pony? Applejack is best pony. I'm sorry, that's <laughs> the wrong answer. The correct answer is Trixie, but thank you for playing. <laughs> hey, no. We're not playing really that fun. game. Okay, okay. We can pretend okay. this This is Applejack, best Applejack. I think that we can concisely say that. I completely best agree with that. Best Applejack. So, and, and how are you enjoying the convention so far? I love it so far. And what has been your favorite part? Would you say? Um, probably my probably my favorite part so far has pretty much just been getting into here because it was because it was definitely very hectic. Yeah, it, it's it's very crazy here today. That's that's for sure. And is there anything in particular that you're looking forward to seeing today? I'm looking forward to getting the autographs from Lauren Faust, Tara Strong, and then also John Delancey. And I'm also looking forward to the cosplay photo shoot. And are you planning to fit in any apple bucking during this time? Maybe. <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you so much for talking with us. Enjoy the convention. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. We're about to okay. not, so let's stop this. We'll, uh, we'll right. be right back. Once again, reporting from the convention floor here at BronyCon, I am TechRat along with... Joe Stevens. From the Equestrian Inquirer for Everfree Radio. And we're here right now with two rather unique cosplayers cosplaying characters that you normally wouldn't see here on the convention floor and that would be Mr. and Mrs. Cake along with these incredibly adorable plushies they've made for Pound and Pumpkin. So my first question to you is did you make these plushies yourself? I did make the plushies myself. They're my first dolls I ever made but I did turn, they turned out pretty well in my opinion. Uh, uh, excellent. Excellent for a first effort. Unbelievable. And, and what inspired you to cosplay as Mr. and Mrs. Cake? Because I have to say it's a rather um, unique choice I would think. Well, I once, co I once uh, cosplayed as Twilight, but my boyfriend wanted a couple cosplay with me, so I decided Mr. and Mrs. Cake was the best option. That is a wonderful idea. And how do you feel about that? Yeah, pretty good, I guess. I mean, <laughs> nothing, against it. nothing against it at all. Okay. Okay. All right. We, we, you, you're really pulling off the Mr. and Mrs. Cake look. I think that if there was a couples cosplay contest, then that you'd win it hands down. And I Absolutely. think you're definitely in the running for the cosplay in general. Mainly because these little things are just adorable. It, 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 it just fits the full picture. Oh, yes. It, it, it just contributes to it. It's wonderful. You just need a Pinkie Pie to come around and just start 
having her throwing things at them. The, the, oh, and at he some even flowers. has the shoes. Did you see the shoes? Oh, look at the shoes. He's even got the shoes. Look at the shoes. I mean, all look the at way that. head to toe. It's perfect. It's beautiful. It's wonderful. Yes. Well, thank you very much. Oh, we, we don't want to keep you. We know that the voice actress panel is next, and we know that you're wanting to get in there. We're all wanting to get in there. So thank you so much for allowing us to Thank you for you. taking the time. Thank we appreciate much. it. And enjoy the convention. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right.